Guys, you're out here practicing, and uh, what's it like here uh, as you get ready for a new season? I'll start with you, Chevy. Senior year, what, what's going through your mind? Um, honestly, just kind of prepping up a lot of the young guys. You know, missing a lot of you know guys in the final game last year, so just got to get the next guys ready and, and you know showing that they're important too. Their job matters just as much as all of ours. So just kind of making everyone else take another step up. Bro, you guys are the defending 2A champs. Uh, does that carry a little extra added pressure at all coming into this year? Or? Uh, yeah, a little bit, but not you know much. Uh, you know, we do have a younger team, but uh, there, a lot of them are stepping up. Uh, of the younger kids, so I'm excited to see what they have, and I'm excited to see what this year comes to have. Obviously, you guys did lose a, a good group of seniors. So, as veterans that have been through the battles, what do you kind of instill to the younger guys? What do you tell them? You know, don't be scared. Take it head on first. You know, um, if you're gonna, you know, just stand there and like it hit you, you ain't gonna get better. You need to go head on first, and you know, take on the challenge and become better and uh, sharpen your skills. You know? Chevy, how would you describe two way football, particularly out here in the West? Um, Honestly, I mean, it's tough. It's like, I mean, even on the east side, it's any team can win. Like, any team can win. Last year it was neck and neck, you know. I mean, you had two teams barely fall out of the playoffs. And just a lot of tough competition. Everyone's kind of evenly matched. You just really never know what's going to happen. What are you looking forward to the most your senior year? Uh, just playing the game, honestly. I mean, it's been a long time since I played again, so I just can't wait to get back out on the field. What about for you, Ro? Oh, man, I just want to go out. I want to hit, and I want to, you know, show people what this team is made of, you know. I think we've gotten a lot of, uh, maybe not disrespect, but we've been, uh, you know, kind of the underdogs for a while, and I enjoy it, and I, you know, I want to get up there. All right. So, what have you kind of focused on these first few days in practice, and, and where do you need to go before you guys get your first game? I think you had a scrimmage before your first game, but where, where do you feel like you need to go in the next week or so? Um, or what do you need to focus on? Personally, I think it's a lot of technique, especially in the D-line, you know, watching Watching get off and you know getting your uh, just you know reps in the get off people just trying to get close to the quarterback and trying to stop the plays early on on defense and then offense trying to get off the ball on time get on their hip and push it down. Is there anything else you'd add to that? Yeah, I mean honestly, just kind of getting everything to fall in place. I mean, you know, you get two weeks before your game before you're, you know you're just full on. You know, first day of full pads, so <laughs> just kind of got to get everyone believing in themselves. You know, get everyone disciplined, do their jobs, no one else's, and, and they'll fall in place. How was that first day of pads? It was awesome. It was fun. I wish I could do some other drills, but it was, it was a good day. <laughs> <laughs> what do you guys love the most in terms of? Playing for Lyman and, and playing for Coach Anderson. Yeah, I just like being out here with the kids, and like even like the younger to the older. It's just always fun being out there and having a fun time, and then you know getting to you know hit each other and you know, you have a little bit of difference and disagreements. You can come out here and debate it out. <laughs> yeah. Is there anything you'd add? I, honestly, I think like the the small town support is really where it's at. I think I think you know you don't got much to do on a on a Friday afternoon, so you come out and you watch football, you watch boys hit. So. Support's really, really there. What does it for me. What's your guys' favorite part of, of going on road trips? Oh, just being on, the, being on the bus is long, but sometimes being on the bus and you get to stay in those hotels, it can be, it can be fun. <laughs> I enjoy it a lot. <laughs> What's going on in the bus rides? Um, sleeping? I sleep. I sleep. I, we're coming back from the game, it's a lot of sleeping, but I'm always trying to stay up and kind of get myself you know, hyped up for the game coming up. What, what are you doing to hype yourself up? Uh, sometimes I'll just be I'll just be hanging out and just having fun, just talking to everyone, seeing, you know, the latest gossip around school. I guess. <laughs> Chevy, what are you doing to hype yourself up? Uh, watch film. Honestly, I just I don't know. I like I like watching you know, good plays by our team. The bad plays kind of gets the intensity going for me. Speaking to the road, what's your guys' favorite food? Favorite place to eat away from home? Your favorite food, man. I could go for a like burger right now. <laughs> I know, I just want a burger, dog. <laughs> so anywhere that has a burger? Yeah, yes sir. They don't, have, there... they don't have Chick-fil-A nowhere but Cheyenne. We gotta go to Cheyenne. Yeah, that's that's very true. Did you stop there coming back from the championship last year from Torrington? Uh, no, we didn't. We went to the steakhouse. Oh, that's better. That's <laughs> yeah, a little that's better. better. That's a little better. What 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 is your favorite like pregame meal? Uh, pre-game, man, I just like a nice big pasta. Yeah. Same for you. Carbs, 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 protein, stuff like that. All right. I know. I know Mountain View's a, a big rival of you guys. But is there anybody else you really look forward to playing during the year? Uh, I'm excited. I hope we get to see uh, Torrington and Plas would be a good one. Or we have them out. It's a, those are be tough games, and I want to play someone tough. I want to give us a challenge and also you know, level. They're always uh, we go up there this year. It's a long trip, and that's going to be a battle. I know that they have that big uh, Lindsay, Quinn Lindsay. Well, it's a heck of an athlete, respect to him so much, but man, I'm excited to play him, I'm excited to go out there and play them.
Anybody else? I just, just want to see Big Piney. Oh, yeah. That's why I want to get that. <laughs> Uh-oh. Something, something happened in the past? Yeah, we lost to him last year. That's we lost oh, that's right. Year. That's so, right. You want to get that revenge, huh? Back. Iron sharpens stainless steel. <laughs> <laughs> Rose got the sayings today. Hey, guys, I appreciate the time. Best of luck this year. Thank, Thank you.